While my mom is making this cake, the perfect prank to pull on my dad just comes to mind. While she is putting the physical cake in the oven, I thought, hmm, what if I had a bun in my oven? Does that sound, that sounds really gross. But you know what I mean, you know? I have a baby, that's what I'm trying to say. Big baby. Okay. Let's prank slide. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, should I put it's a boy, it's a girl? Oh. I'm putting this baby here. This prank is so perfect because it has been months since he's seen me around my boyfriend. He doesn't actually know how serious that we are. So for all he knows, I could be cooking something up right now. <laughs> ah! <laughs> that's funny. That is actually so good. The girls and I spent all day making a cake for Sly. It's a really special cake and it has a life-changing surprise. Life-changing? Yeah. <laughs> okay. And this, and this light. So well, how is this life-changing? Can you bring the cake out? Because we, we want it to sit in the middle. Right. <laughs> Adam, that's, well, that's, 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 that's okay. It's funny. Okay. This is a big buildup of this cake. It better be good. Looks guilty already. Oh my god. <laughs> hey, don't drop it on me, man. Sly's like got oil skids. Oh. <laughs> oh god, this is so classic. Oh no! That might be the worst cake I've ever seen in my life. Every year, Jennifer makes a traditional disaster in the shape of a cake. And this one looks like it was assaulted, literally. You want to make a police report and say, somebody beat up my cake. But on the side of the cake are these weird Chucky dolls and toys and things that just, they make no sense on my cake. What are these babies doing here? Dad, read this, read this. What does it say? It says, boy. OK, what does that mean? Oh, no. Don't say, why? <laughs> What's that mean? Sistine? Sistine is going to have... No. <laughs> no. You're going to be a grandfather. Please turn these cameras off for a second so I can destroy this place. I'm going full Rambo, pal. Ooh, I got a good idea. Let's make this the weirdest place setting. Yeah, 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 yeah. I have a creative vision for Scarlet's farewell lunch, and I stuck with it. <laughs> Don't go in the other room! Keep going. That's gnarly. I happen to have this artificial heart. It's from the last Rambo scene when I did this job on my enemy there. And I pulled out his heart. Like, why not? This will go here. Because Scarlet has our heart. I'm expecting the reaction to be heartless. <laughs> Scarlet, table is set to the nine. Oh my god. Oh no. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> wowza, wowza, wowza. Are you hungry? No, 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 that's so unappetizing. Scarlett, you have our heart. Oh, I'm going to miss you guys so much. Martha Stewart would be so proud.